Unity 2021.1 is officially released. And in this version, Bolt is integrated into Unity and it's now called Visual Scripting. There are some visual changes. Let's take a look at it. What I'm gonna start with is show you how you can import macros that you made in the previous versions. As an example, I'm gonna use the early access package of easy mode in Unity. So you can just drag the package, click import and if we take a look at the folders here, you can see that the scripts are actually not recognized. So to fix this, what you actually can do is go to project settings. And right here we have a visual scripting. This is where all the settings were moved. And what you want to run is this fix missing scripts. You click fix missing scripts. It's going to find those macros and you can replace a reference now. Click OK. We can close that now and here we go. Now all of these assets are recognized. And if I go into any of these nodes by clicking edit graph, Unity is gonna import all the files that it needs to display the graphs. The import is done and here is the new look of the graph. So the visual of the units actually changed. This is how they look right now. Some of the icons changed and if we pull up the units, you can see more of the icons changes here. Other than that, there's not that much changes with the units. One thing that I'll mention is that in 2021, Visual Scripting actually supports the new input system. So if you switch to the new input system, you'll get new units that you can use for the new input system. Now, if you're importing a project like I'm doing here, so something like this, and if in a project you have these prefects that are connecting, so currently the laser was actually connected successfully, but you can see that there is an error with the explosion. The prefab is not found. You can manually just find that prefab and just select it from the list and fix it like that. But if you have lots of those prefabs that are connected, one way you can go about, and I showed this in the previous video, is you import the project the second time. So right here, I can remove this folder, click delete, add it back, import all of it, go to the project settings, fix the missing scripts again, replace, and then you need to restart the project. So close the project, open the project again. And now if we run the game, we shouldn't get those errors anymore. So let's try it out. So the explosion is working and all of the prefabs are connected correctly. So this is just a quick look at how visual scripting is looking in this version and how you can import your previous macros into this version. If you want to get the early access of the collection of units that I'm working, the link is in description. By getting it, you'll be supporting this channel and also the development of that project. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.